Builders want to offer pay-as-you-go payment solutions, which is why we are building Chip. So let's see it in action. Head over to chip.ai to get started. There you can find the documentation and click get started, which will take you to app.chip.ai. Log in if you already have an account or sign up with Google or an email. I'm going to go ahead and choose an email address that doesn't have an account. So we'll go here and click this one. As soon as you log into your account, if you're brand new, you'll be prompted to create your application. You can connect Stripe, which is how you will get paid. I'm going to go ahead and skip for now. And then you'll be prompted to create your new application. I'll go ahead and choose the YC app that I have developed. Now within YC, you'll see that we have the checkout page that customers will see right here. So we make it really easy for these developers and builders to spin up their payment page. This is the URL that they'll share with their customers. And then they can customize it however they want with different colors that are reflected over here on the right-hand side. They can name the app and then they can choose how many credits users will get when they sign up. So they get those free credits. And now they have a page that's ready for checkout. They can choose if they want different packages than what we recommend. So besides the one five and monthly subscription, they can go in here and add new credit packages or edit them. And we can see that the, the checkout page will work when we go to the branding and checkout. If someone shows five credits, for example, they're gonna go ahead and click pay. And that's gonna take them to the Stripe checkout flow. So what we're doing is making it really easy for these builders to add that kind of payment solution, to add that pay as you go in front of the, the Stripe checkout. So they get the security and the trust that you would expect with Stripe, but make it really easy for builders to spin these up. Now, the last step after they have their checkout page is to integrate it into their app. So we just have a simple API key that they can copy. Then we have documentation they can click on to easily install. That's always available at docs.chip.ai. And you can see we have our Node.js, Python, all right here. Really easy to click into any of these and install. So that's a little look at the docs and how to get everything set up. So what happens once things are set up? Well, on the left-hand side, developers and builders can add more applications. If they want to have multiple apps running with Chip, they can do that. And then they can actually see and track the data of their apps right here on the dashboard. So let's go ahead and switch over to an account that has some data in it. And we're tracking the revenue and the users for all of the applications that the builder is using. Now we can also track this on a per transaction basement basis. By clicking over to payments, you can see here each transaction that comes through. And then we can easily filter that by application or by individual users to see which users are buying what things. And that's gonna give us a lot of insight that we can then use in our uh, alternative data product. So as we learn which customers are buying which packages, we're able to really help with price discovery and give insights on which apps are growing and what's most popular in the market. So Chip is a really easy way for those developers to spin up that pay-as-you-go solution and to track their activity right here on the dashboard. We look forward to building this tool out at YC.